Next kingdom is Protista. It includes single celled eukaryotes. As they are eukaryotes, they have well defined nucleus as well as membrane bound organelles in their cell body. In this kingdom, the first category is chrysophytes. Chrysophytes have diatoms, diatoms plus golden algae. These are microscopic organisms, photosynthetic in nature. Diatoms have thin overlapping shells and they fit into each other as the soap box fits in. These are the main producers of oceans and in their cell wall silica is present and once they are deposited they form diatomaceous earth which is being pretty in nature used in polishing, filtration etc. Next category in this is dinoflagellates. These are marine organisms photosynthetic in nature. They could be of red, green, brown and many other colors depending upon the pigment present in the cell body. Their cell wall is consisting of cellular plates. They have two flagellas and they release toxins and their toxin is believed to be so toxic in nature that it may kill even all of the marine life including fishes. Next in this kingdom is euglenoids. These are freshwater organisms found in stagnant water. Cell wall is absent in their case. A protein rich deposition known as pellicle or pellicle is present. They have got two flagella. One is short and one is long. They show both autotrophic as well as heterotrophic mode of nutrition. Whenever sunlight is available, they become photosynthetic in nature that is autotrophic mode of nutrition. But whenever sunlight is absent, they show predation, predating on smaller organisms. Next is slime molds. These are basically saprophytic in nature. They grow and forms the aggregate known as plasmodium which is found to be grown over several feet. They have got a stage of fruiting stage in their life cycle in which they produce spores and these spores have true walls. Next in this kingdom is protozoans. Protozoans are heterotrophic in nature majorly consisting of predators and parasites. The various type of protozoans are amoeboids, flagellated, ciliated and sporozoans. Amoeboid is something which is from amoeba. Flagellated protozoans are having flagella. Ciliated protozoans are having cilia and sporozoans are the one which have spores formation or which show spore formation during their life cycle. So this is kingdom protista.